So personally, I think uh, within short noise, you, you won't find that the typical bread and butter sounds. I mean, yes, of course, some of these are in there as well, but uh, not the, the kind of typical sound you would expect. It's, it's, it's really different. People often ask me, what is short noise? What, what can it do for me? What does it sound like? So then I can only say to them, check out the demo. Uh, no, just kidding. Um, I think you can't put short noise into a category. It's, it's, it's kind of a prodigious showcase. So um, you get arpeggios, leads, basses, pets, uh, effects, ambient textures and, and the like. And yes, and, and these are, Personally, I think these are no ordinary sounds. I'd say, yeah, there's, there's, life, in it. there's life in these sounds. When I started uh, designing short noise and the sounds and instrument for it, I thought, give it a different approach. I mean, I mean, we all do love sounds when making music, so what would really help in developing musical ideas, what would truly inspire. So I thought, why not make the sounds kind of different? I think where short noise really shines is that all the instruments and of course the multi-performances have a, have a lot of uh, hidden ambience uh, effects in between, you know, that kind of blurry thing going on in the background. And uh, of course you have to then the, the possibility to tweak everything like you desire. So I think, yeah, almost any sound in short noise makes use of velocity, modulation, we and pitch bender, so I can only advise you to check it out.